Yeah, I love Indiana history. This is Samson Levinson. I'm a storyteller, history lover, history tour guide right here in Indianapolis, Indiana. And I can't be more grateful to participate in this program with New Fields. Um, looking at the art in the IMA is almost overwhelming. And so to kind of narrow it down, of course, I was looking at Indiana artists and then one in particular, John Wesley Hardrick. I first got introduced to his art about a year ago, and I saw the way he painted, painted Indiana's landscapes, right? He painted what he saw. He was in love with the surroundings, and that's something that I can really resonate with. At a time when many people that looked like him weren't doing that, he was doing that and expressing his love in a, in a very beautiful way. That's what I try to do for 3 2 Eyes. I try to show my love for Indiana. Um, as I'm exploring new fields, I come across Dolly and Rach, and I instantly see the way that they are communicating with one another. At a very young age, eye contact. Look how they're holding each other's hands. You can tell that it comes from a place of love, right? The answer's coming from love. The question's coming from love. And I feel like that's something that we forget that we need. It's part of our nature, right? Just as Hardrick is painting Indiana's nature, now he's painting human nature. And that is communication, right? As we grow older, we have to continue to have these conversations. We have to understand that it's a necessity. It has to happen. It has to happen. We have to communicate with each other from a place of love and understanding. And that's what they're doing here as siblings. I think about the conversations I used to have with my sister, right? No matter how they end it, no matter how they start it, you know, we love each other. And I think that's what we need to do as a human race. We're brothers and sisters. If, if these two young girls can figure that out, they need to have a conversation. They need to look each other in the eye and talk about something. This seems pretty serious, right? Look at them. They look like they're talking about something serious, but they love each other. So they got to talk. They gotta speak, they gotta figure it out. And I think that's something that we're losing as, as we become so polarized, we think we don't need the other side. We don't need this person. We don't need to communicate, but we do. And it has to come from a place of love or it just simply won't work. And I think that's all that Hardrick's showing here, right? These two girls, Dolly and Rach, they love each other. They're having a serious conversation, right? That's what we need to do as, as a people. So. And to continue to, explore, to continue to explore, I'm sorry, the rest of the exhibits here at New Fields, all the other stuff going on, all the programs and activities, and then come back, look at Dolly and Rach again, right? And just kind of think about that communication, how that's part of our nature and how we need to ramp it up. I feel like as we grow older, we sometimes forget that we need this. It's not optional. We need it, right? We need each other. We need to love where we are. We, <laughs> I love Indiana, so... Love new fields too. All right, I'll see you guys. Thank you for checking that out.